Meg roared with pain. Netflix show threatened over Kate, newest look in Royal Concert promo, destroying Meg. Kate delighted royal fans by sharing a behind-the-scenes snap ahead of a much-anticipated Christmas carol service. In the photograph shared by the Prince and Princess of Wales' official Twitter account, Kensington Royal, Prince William's wife smiles while looking straight into the camera. Behind her can be seen a fireplace decorated with a festive wreath, a Christmas tree with red, white and golden bows and baubles and wrapped presents. Fans were quick to take to social media to comment on the new picture. A fan account for the Waleses, at Love Wales Family, tweeted, The princess looks so beautiful. Can't wait for this year's Christmas concert. Another fan of Kate, Toria at Toria H, wrote, Loving the garter fireplace in the equerry office. Exciting. My friends are off to our local hashtag together at Christmas. A third, Diana, at Diana, replied to Kensington Royal's original tweet to say, Wow, the Princess of Wales looks stunning and so classy. Finally, at Alpha Bella London paid a major compliment to the royals, saying, I can't help but feel that in a very subtle way, Her Royal Highness the Princess of Wales is also standing in for our late Queen. First Christmas without our beloved Queen Elizabeth. What a wonderful and touching tribute the Princess of Wales has paid to her. This picture was shared alongside another promotional photo already released by ITV on Saturday. Kate is to take centre stage on Thursday evening as she'll spearhead the second together at Christmas special. A few hours prior, Netflix will have released the second half of Harry and Meghan, a docuseries including a first-hand account by the Duke and Duchess of Sussex about their life and struggles as working royals. The service, held at Westminster Abbey, will celebrate the importance of togetherness, as well as people who've gone above and beyond to support their communities up and down the country. Moreover, this year's service will also include a tribute to late Elizabeth II, who died at Balmoral Castle back in September. The Princess of Wales, who first launched together at Christmas in 2021, will lead this initiative supported by Kate and William's Royal Foundation. In a major show of support and unity, King Charles and Queen Camilla will head to the Abbey in central London to attend the event in person, alongside other members of the firm. Last year, Sophie Countess of Wessex, Zara and Mike Tyndall and Princess Beatrice were among the family members who'd stepped out to be at the service. Prince William will also be in attendance and will be among the guests delivering a reading. The Carol Concert, which promises to mix modern and tradition, will include a number of A-listers such as actor Hugh Bonneville and singer Mel C. The service will be televised by ITV on Christmas Eve, with the Royal Carols together at Christmas. The broadcast will add extra footage including a tribute to the late Sovereign. Last year, ITV included in its programme a clip of Kate playing the piano to accompany singer Tom Walker, which took royal fans by storm. In other news, Meghan Markle and Prince Harry are a massive threat to the survival of the royal family. Royal family former divisional commander Di Davies says that the Duchess of Sussex could pose serious damage to Prince Harry's relatives with her explosive Netflix confessions. Mr Davies claimed, There's a small minority that think Meghan walks on water. I've always said there's a greater risk from fixated individuals than there is from terrorists. Because their narrative has been attached to race to the extent it has, you could have those at the extreme end of the taking knee variety having a go at members of the royal family. I really think that it could create a small minority who might in fact think it's a credible threat and I think it should be taken very seriously, especially now the documentaries come out.